Good morning and namaste to one and all. My name is Neha Mahesh and I am studying in Bhavan's Vidya Mandir Elamakara in the 9th grade. Today I am here before you all to speak on the topic Youth Addiction and Abuse of Technology as part of Read India Celebrations 2021. When I first got this topic, what I tried to do was explore the question Is technology a boon or a curse? As we all know, Technology has become such an integral part of our life that we cannot imagine life without it. Our daily lives depend upon it. So I try to list some of the pros and cons of technology. The pros of technology are as follows. It saves time, helps in better communication. It helps us easily spend our time. It develops better learning method. It improves efficiency for business, gives us more job opportunities and it makes research become simple. Now I looked at the cones of technology which are as follows. It can be powerfully destructive. It leads to health problems. It creates a lack of privacy. It can be expensive and it can create a feeling of social disconnect. It can also lead to digital media manipulation and helps people in creating fake personas. And the most important thing is it can lead to addiction. And we will become over reliant on gadgets. And the list of pros and cons go on and on. Hence, technology is a necessary evil. Proper and controlled use of technology can make our life more comfortable, whereas misuse or overuse of it can have severely adverse effects. To make sure that children like me don't misuse it, proper methods of using technology must be taught to us. Now, here are some methods which I found useful in using technology properly. Maintaining a balanced schedule, that is to have fixed timings for using gadgets. Now engaging in or healthy offline activities like reading, taking a walk or exercising. Taking proper care of health and posture while using technology. Manage gaming timing. Never sacrifice sleep for screen time. And to connect with people around you, that is to socialize. Follow proper gu guidelines while using social media. And to never befriend strangers on social media or share personal information with them. Now the most important thing that I found is that we should stretch our body and relax our eye muscles every 20 minutes while using gadgets. So these are some of the things that I found while researching on this topic. I hope you will all follow these guidelines and let us have a better tomorrow. Thank you.